boy. So we're, we're in the garage now. So anyway, uh, trying to look for the old U joint. Okay, this is the old U joint. So what I had to do is get an angle ground to get this out because I can't get the you know the caps on each side. Yeah, so look at that. That doesn't look very good on it. Blobs re smudged. Burns don't work. And then this is what the old ones look like. I got from the drive shaft shot side. This was like on the clamps. Hold on from like the the yoke from the front of the rear axle. So the, that one has a hole in it. And there's almost nothing left in there. So this is how bad it looked. So it, it probably took me two and a, almost two and a half hours doing it. So I had my roommate to help. Yep. That's all he had to do. Let's get right back in there. And then I had to use two uh, small sockets, like that size. Just get these caps off. I mean, the new caps in with the vise. I'm gonna close the jaws first. Yeah, that's the angle grinder I used. Next time I'm gonna buy a diamond blade. Okay, now we're gonna look underneath the truck. wheel chocks as well because I got the parking brake on the wheel chock there the wheel chock in the front wheel that way when I take the drive shaft off I'm gonna accidentally run me over and run into the garage and here's my snap on creeper uh, all right and here we are so basically you take those two bolts that you know bolt that hold on that clip just like I said in our earlier on the other video and get the shot off and it easily slides right off the, the slip yoke where the transmission is at yeah then you had to get these clips that's not where the caps are at that's the hard part yeah and pretty soon I need to get that differential flush yeah. Let's see if it makes those noise but oh shoot I gotta put a wrench back I forgot to put a wrench back anyway well these are my work boots now so i got this you know the the boot the boot protectors yeah so i had to trace the outlines of it and then sand inside the surface and then outside yeah and i thought i had it for a while but this will work good so i'm thinking maybe i get a can of you know spraying bell arm spray just uh the steel toe part Yeah. So this will be it for now.